everyone so today I have a collection video for you guys and as you can see from the title it is Bath and Body Works this is gonna be my lotion portion so if you didn't know I used to work for Bath and Body Works I'm not like I don't like have like a whole video like dedicated to it but I did I might eventually make one once like it's been a little more time just because it's very personal and like very close and I still know a lot of the people so I'm just gonna wait until like you know retail does the things and it like cycles out the workers so um yeah before I worked to Bath and Body Works I think I might have walked into Bath and Body Works maybe five times in my life and I didn't own candles and I was like a pretty happy person I own a bajillion candles now and I hardly use them I had to uh, force myself to use them I have a gazillion shower gels and everything you can think of just because of the way Bath & Body Works is with like the gratis, with um, after inventory. There's a lot of products Bath & Body Works has to throw away that they can't sell. So they let the associates pay for like a bag. You pay $5 like a bag and you're allowed to fill it up as much as you want with the product that's going to get thrown away. So I've gone through... Uh, like two of those so and I bought a couple of bags so I have a lot of things and because my channel is more focused on project panning I kind of need to use them up because like everything else lotions and shower gels and candles and perfumes they go bad and I don't know I have spent quite a lot of money on these things so I'm gonna show you guys my collection this is gonna be my body lotion collection and I'm going to show you like the other lotions I have too that aren't Bath & Body Works, but like 95% of my collection is Bath & Body Works. And then we'll find out. I think I have around like 28 bottles, but I might have accumulated more. Anyways, let's just jump right into my collection. So this is the bag I store my Bath & Body Works lotions in. I know it doesn't seem like it's that much, but trust me, this is full. At least for one person that doesn't use lotions like on an everyday basis so I'm going to organize this just so you guys can see okay guys so I actually have 29 bottles of full lotion I do have two full-size lotions that I'm almost halfway through that I'm not including in this video and then I have one in my car and one in my purse so this is like the overview this is a lot for me I mean it might not be for someone but I'm just gonna go through the collection sorry I had to do it like kind of holding the camera and on the floor but it is what it is so I have a vineyard champagne kiss and orchid leaf sky leaves and blue sky these you can no longer get these were this was actually from I want to say fall 2015 and this was from this last fall when they introduced their new ultra shade body creams you can still get these Tahiti Island Dream and Hello Beautiful as you can see it has a gratis sticker on it these are except for Paris more but I mean they used to be like this is still a part of their signature collection um, my favorite out of these is probably Endless Weekend Love and Sunshine and I used to have a love for Paris more but You'll probably see it during the semi-annual sale because they just put it in. They just discontinued it this last December. We have French Lavender and Honey, which as you can see is my favorite, or well, at least one of my favorites. You can still purchase these, and as you can see, I have two full sizes and a mini. So these were this last summer, and Sunshine Days has become my favorite non-holiday scent. And I, I'm really sad I only have these two lotions but during the semi-annual sale there might be a chance that they bring this back and if it is there I am going to like super stock up on it because that's the only time you should really be buying stuff from Bath & Body Works because it's the best price honestly especially if you can get it for 75% off but Sunshine Days is my favorite and then this is from the same collection that's why I put it together and it's um it's good but again it's not it's one of their seasonal collections not something you can find every day I have the true blue spa super rich body cream this is from obviously their true blue spa line but you can still get it from Bath and Body Works unfortunately you can't get these two agava papaya sunset oh it smells so good I only have one lotion and one shower gel left and I'm kind of like 
I don't know when I want to use it because I'm savoring it and then this is like super old and I hate this scent and it's in the old packaging but um, sometimes I'll just use it over my legs when I mean I already went through a bottle of this but I just I don't like it so that is that then over here I have my non Bath and Body Works lotions which is just a let's go over here this is the Body Shop Body Butter, and this is in the Shea, I want to say. I don't know. It doesn't say, but it looks like it's Shea. And then this is, sorry for the super shakiness. This is the Daisy Oh So Fresh um, Body Lotion. It came with the perfume set. I have this pink Cool and Bright Body Lotion. I got the whole set of this for free for being, like, card holder. So they have their benefits, and it's, like, supposed to get you to buy more. I also have the Jergens BB Body. I uh, one of the lotions that I have open right now is that one. It's not my favorite, but I bought a two pack and I bought the light colored one, so I don't really see that much of improvement. A lot of people say buy the medium one. Going back to Bath and Body Works products, I have the Sweet Magnolia and Clementine. Uh, this one's really good. From this collection, the Sheer Cotton Lemonade is my favorite. I've already gone through a bottle of this, and so now I have two left. They did bring it back this last semi-annual sales, so if you see it, it's definitely something you should look out for. But ironically, when this collection came out, I didn't like it. So it might be just because like, when you work at Bath & Body Works, there's so many fragrances that you can't really experience or like... <sighs> Uh, what am I trying to say? Like, enjoy the fragrance because you smell so much you don't know what, what, what smells like. Over here, we have my Winter Candy Apple collection, and this is my all-time favorite. But unfortunately, you can only get this in December. So, as you can see, I have three full sizes of the body cream, a body lotion, and then a mini body lotion. Um, yeah, it's safe to say I super stock up on this. And then the last one is my Frosted Snow Blossom Lotion. I got this one in gratis from that collection. You can't get it. It was like the beginning of winter collection, and it's okay. It was my favorite out of the bunch, but it's not my favorite, if that makes sense. So that was my body lotion collection, body cream, all of that stuff. I will be doing a video for my candles, my shower gels, and my sprays after this. Not right after, I'll probably upload one maybe once every three weeks just so it's not like collection, 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 collection and just give you something to look forward to and to anticipate. But other than that, that's all for now and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.